team has been the roster has been ready to go i just did the rosters probably last weekend and um it's it's no we got everyone returning nobody's leaving so that's good so a lot of our seniors are still here um we bumped up to an 84 overall which is phenomenal but not phenomenal work yeah we got some new faces which is which is cool so right here you see donnie jack in his junior year uh you got michael vick jr now this is what i'm talking about here i'm gonna, I'm gonna do like the whole rosters everything with these rosters you know it's still difficult to um to change skin tone so like i try to do the best i can to make these players how how you guys want them but i'm not gonna lie to y'all <laughs> like the recruiting there's more white dbs than they are like dark skin or lights like mixed colors so it's like i will full of just white dbs and it's like i gotta find a way to you can change the positions and stuff like that so like it's i had to work around the the uh the, the board the recruiting board so like most likely it's like a lot of the safeties are, are are like light or uh mid to dark skin so it's like yeah there's just cooper de jeans like yeah he changed he, he fucked everything up man but it's so most likely they're like safeties so i had to like convert them to cornerbacks to, to make y'all players so all right here we go so this is the squad right now this is what we're looking at uh this is not the death chart this is just the, the rosters what we we are cooking with here um yes s'mores man i want some s'mores man good old s'mores. all right here we, here we go donnie jackson jr he's back in his junior year um 86 overall 93 speed like he's he's actually been a pretty decent dog um this season for uh this season an absolute savage which i like he's a ball player um Freshman Michael Vick Jr. Yes, the Michael Vick Jr. Uh, with a with astonishing 96 speed. Boy, you like your daddy, man. Boy, I tell you, boy, no, 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 man. My boy, my boy, fast. That <laughs> boy, fast. He makes fast people not fast. So, but he's got 95 throwing power, um, 85 short, 83 mid, and 81 deep ball. Uh, 83 throw in the run. Uh, 80 um, throwing pressure, but 74 break sack. Um, but juking, hey, this man's got speed. He doesn't have his his daddy's agility. You know what I'm saying? But we hopefully he'll he'll develop that. Um, you sure it ain't Michael Marcus Vick Jr. Could be. <laughs> it could be. Uh, Brock Lowry. Uh, he is a juke. I believe he's a. I believe he was a juco or a transfer. I believe. Um, sophomore as well, because I don't remember seeing him. Um, Joey Williams, uh, another backup quarterback, another lefty. Um, he's got potential too. Decent player, not a bad, decent stats for for a freshman too, which I like. And uh, he can move a little bit as well. He just hopefully he develops and hopefully stays here with the Bulldogs. Uh, Isaiah Isaiah Best, uh, senior. Cool, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Uh, running backs, Clinton James, his senior year, he is back. He's an absolute savage. He doesn't play like an 83 man. He plays like an 88. I would say 83, or not 83, an 80, 93 overall player. He's got 98 speed. We're talking about a dog. This dude's an absolute dog. 89, 98 speed with 99 acceleration, 90 agility, 89 cutter direction. 59 strength. Get your weight up, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 90 awareness. Uh, 79 ball carrying. 91 cut uh, ball carrying vision. 87 break tackle. 89 trucking. 91 stiff arm. 85 speed. 99 or 89 juke move. 73 catching. So this man can pretty much do some shit, man. This man's literally a, a dog, which I like. Um, his senior year. Hopefully he balls out as well. Uh, backing him up is freshman. Derry Sanders. Derry Sanders. Shut up, Siri. I'm not talking to you. Sorry. Um, so he's the freshman. He's here too, man. So be a lookout for him. Cody Peppers is, is here as well. Um, just an a natural, like just burners, man. Straight burners out here. So we got these two freshmen hopefully do damage throughout their their careers here in uh Riverside University. 
Um, Darius Sanders, a rush, uh, freshman red shirt, standing at 80 overall. This, like, off the rip, 80 overall, 85 speed, 89 acceleration, 91 agility, 94 change of direction. He hit that, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, strength 79, uh, awareness 82, carrying 87, ball carrying at 83, brake tackle at 81, trucking 79, stiff arm 72, spin 73. Juke move 82 with catching at 83. Uh, change direction 75 too. So, I mean, he's he's decent. He's a decent running back. Uh, Cody Peppers. Take a look at him as well. Freshman. 76 overall. 92 speed. 95 acceleration. 89 agility. 87 change of direction. 91 str uh, 81 strength. 72 awareness. Uh, carrying at 86, which we like. Uh... Ball carry at 79, brake 77, trucking at 74, stiff form, and with 83, when spin move of 81, and 91 juke move. We like that a lot. Um, he can't catch the ball. I mean, he could, but it just, he had to be booty hole airs open to catch that football. But I mean, he's decent. Decent running back. I mean, we have a, we have a nice running back class, which I like. Um, and the sophomore here, Cam Bankhead. Now, this is a transfer. I forget where he he came from, but he's got some decent stats, though. 88 speed, 88 uh, acceleration. Um, the best part, too, he's got 90 awareness. He's got 97 carrying. We like that here. Um, and he's just a, I'm a one your ass over, but he, he's tendencies are uh, a receiving back. They do a wrong motherfucker over. All right, let's just keep it a bean. He's, he's. Doesn't have anything about route running or receiving. This man goes, I'm gonna I'm a break some face masks in half. That's that is his main goal. Standing at 5'10 and, and uh 210 too. Uh DT Jones, a junior, another uh transfer. Yo, Siri, I'm not talking to you. Okay. Got all that, but I ain't let talking to you. Um, but he's decent too. He's a junior, he's just there to be there, you know what I'm saying? One type of opportunity, we probably could. But for a junior, it's not that bad. He's actually had, like a pretty decent dog here uh, with with uh, 90 brake tackling and 87 trucking. I mean, we have some we have some <clears throat> dogs out here. Uh, fullback, I believe this is a returning fullback, I believe. How we humble. Um, uh, he's he's all right. We don't use fullbacks. You know what I'm saying? It ain't worry about it. But our junior here, Deuce Stevens. Now, the crazy part, too... I don't know what happened in this patch, but they took every number player, like they took them all. New Stevens was number two. He's number now 19. I don't know why. They just changed a bunch of players' numbers. I don't know because of this patch that came out. I, I don't know. But it, it ruined a lot of these players' numbers. But there you have it. New Stevens, he's back in his junior year here as well. Nine, 84 overall, 96 speed, 94 acceleration, 96 agility, 92 change of direction. Um, with 84 catching, with 83 catching traffic, 82 spec catch, uh, he's got 81 short, 87 mid, but 76 deep route. And I'm keeping a buck with you, it don't matter. This man just balls out, though. Like, it, it's speed. With a deep route, he just runs straight. It's simple as that. He just run, go. You don't give a damn about it. <laughs> I'm going straight. Beat me there. You know what I'm saying? So, but he's got 84 release, so that's just... Oh, and he he'll, he'll go with 90 jumping as well. Uh, he's an absolute dog. Um, uh, number two, I believe. Who's the number two guy? As we look, uh, this is Kayon Maddox. This guy looks pretty cool too. Six five, six five junior. All right. Um, but as you see, oh, from 84 drop down to 10. It's a little, it's a little shaky. But um, oh shit. The sub don't work. Hold on now. Where my alerts at? Where my alerts at? What the shit? I have alerts on. Shout out Cell though, but now I'm pissed off because the alerts didn't come up. Let me find out here. See, this is shit when you like you touch some shit, shit don't work, and it bothers me. 
You know what I'm saying? It bothers me. It makes me mad. I tested out everything last night. Everything was calm, cool, collected. And then when shit happens, shit breaks, you know? But shout out self for the sub. You you the homie. Well, let me see if it if it don't even work. Let me copy it. Sometime the alert. The same one. I do appreciate you so much, much love. I'm trying to figure out where I can, like, um, hear it for y'all. I don't know why it ain't working. Let me see. It says everything here, but it ain't, it ain't popping up on my shit. Shit's annoying, bro. Shit get me irritated. All right, Xavier Campbell, he's back on his senior year, too. He was actually a decent decent dog, too, with 92 speed, uh, 97 acceleration, 90 agility, 86 change of direction. Um, not bad. Like, the problem is with us, we don't we panic when we throw the football. So when he, when he is there, he is there to help us. You know what I'm saying? So that's that's our big, big thing with him. Um, uh, Josh Wright McGee, he is a transfer as well. It's 5'11", kind of a little short head, um, but hopefully he'll, he'll get some touches as well as two. He comes in at 70 overall, 85 speed, 92 acceleration, um, catching 79. Like as we get as we get you know down to the to the receiving core, it, it kind of struggles a little bit. But he's got decent release with 87, with 87 jumping as well. Um, 82 short with 82 mid with 69. <laughs> nice uh, deep route running. So I mean. It's just basic, basic stuff here. Um, Kevin Gordon, freshman, uh, 94 speed, 90th acceleration. Um, he's got, they got burners out here. He's a 78 uh, short route with 79 uh, mid, and then 74 deep route. A release is kind of ass, so you have to find a way to get up out there with 95 jumping. So we'll see. Hopefully he gets some touches too. Um... We got Trey Hunter here, 95 speed for a 79, 67 overall, 95 speed, 89 acceleration, 90 agility, uh, strength is a 49, this man, this is going to be a little rough, he's got 76 ca catching, uh, 71 catching traffic, 81 spec catch, <laughs> this is this is where it gets scary, uh, short route running is a 58 with mid at 69 and deep route at 74, Big old oof is what I say with 84 jumping. It's just God bless you. Uh, Tamar Harris, he's a freshman red shirt. Now, I believe he. I can't edit him. I think this is a, yeah, this is not a custom recruit. But um, Kevin and Trey are. But yeah, uh, Tamar Harris. It's just what it is, man. It just stinks. And he, he ain't gonna even smell the field. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Uh, tight ends. Tight ends are back. Tight ends have been the same, I think, since la uh, last year, too, as well. So we're, we're, we're pretty good with that. Uh, with Sterling Singleton, he's back. And he's been the dog for us anyway, as well, with 86 speed and, and uh, 89 catching. His route running has been phenomenal. Bumped up to an 89. His mids an 85, which 70 or 68 deep route. Uh, he's got decent blocking, which I like for a tight end. 72, 71, like overall is, is perfect. This is what we like to see. Um, but yeah, everyone else, the tight ends have been the decent for us, which we don't mind. Uh, Anderson and Gold, which has been pretty well. Uh, tackles, left tackle here. You got senior Chase Perry, 
I'm at 84 overall. This is going to be his final year. Good uh, good offensive lineman. Decent stats over here. Moving into 85. He's got 91 run block finesse. Uh, 94 lead block. So that man is going to find the second level and run somebody over. That's what we like to see. Uh, Junior Ricard, uh, Rashad Harkins. He's there too as well. Motherfucker, sorry for cussing. All right, dude. Let's settle down. Settle down. Uh, backup on him is Pat Pancake Harris. He is our um, custom recruit as well. So the linemen are starting to come back too, which we like from the previous uh, season or first year recording. And now, once we get you know some channel points and people can help out, these guys are gonna be some dogs. Um, Brian Blazemore. Decent like a lot of our offensive line has been struggling throughout the mud. So there ain't really nothing crazy about uh, Lennox Laurie. He's a, a custom recruit too. So he's up here as well um, They're decent stats, but I mean when you think about it the Lyman ratings are tough when you're in the bottom like if you're not getting a four-star to five-star lineman You're gonna get shit. So it is what it is, but it's decent stats. It's just got to be better. Hopefully throughout the seasons He comes a dog uh, guards, we got Bubba Brand. He's back, big Bubba. His year and year, he's been a dog for us too. Uh, Chauncey Richards is back here too. Uh, or excuse me, he's our freshman. He's once again a custom recruit. Um, so we're, we're hopefully when when big Bubba leaves, you know, Chauncey's gonna be back and, and filling that that gap in and for uh for guard. Uh, Tyler Van Gordon, you know, sophomore. It is what it is. stinks. Uh, Trevor Dempsey uh, is our senior with 84 overall. Great, great center. Um, behind him is Joshua uh, Glazer Jr., sophomore. Decent stats too. Like it's just not not too shabby for the run for the run game, which we like to see because we do like to run the ball a lot here. Uh, Jalen Irons, uh, sophomore too. These are all I think transfers. I think one of these one of these were transfers. So it was. I think that's probably our best idea to um, to get <laughs> to recruit linemen during the season because everybody wants to be a skill player. So we try to find some three-star to four-star JUCO transfer linemen. We'll we'll be okay. Uh, Taylor, uh, Taylor Lalolis, I butcher the shit out of that. Always do. It's just funny because I know he gets pissed off and slams his keyboard. Uh, but he starts in at 70 overall as a customer recruit. Uh, but not bad, though. 91 strength. This boy, a big hole. That boy, that boy, a little heavy. Um, but decent stats, though. Not bad for passing. Run blocking, he will work on. But we'll be all right. He's a pass protector. So hopefully, you know, proceed to do that. Um, right guard, Cody Rourke. He's back. He's been our dog this whole, like, time he's been here. This is going to be his last year, too. He's got everything on silver. Like, we're going to be fine. And a lot of these are all... In are all um, returning and I think custom tra or, uh, transfers as well. So we're, we're it's like I said, man, like I've been Godzilla versus King Kong. Hell, you like Godzilla and King Kong because I'm both. That's true. That's true. Shout out Jacob Fatu. All right. Um, but yeah, these are like not not too shabby line. Like hopefully throughout the year we, we will be decent. Uh, Mason Waterfield, he's going to be back. He's been like lights out. He's got everything on gold too. Um, so right, the right side of the field should be decent. Behind him is Alex Rentworth, a junior. Hopefully, he'd be a dog. He's six seven two thirty, so he's gonna be a monster. All right. Um, defense side of the ball. All right. Defense side of the ball. Jay Sean Red is back. His senior year, I ain't gonna lie. He's been he's been a dog all year. I'm thinking this man's gonna split. He said, "Nah, I'm loyal. We running it back respectfully." So Jay Sean Red, he's there as well. He's gonna be an out like he's gonna be outstanding. I just know he'll be. He's got 98 play rec. He's all over the football with 85 block shed, 94 hit power. Like he's got 90 pursuit. Like he <laughs> he's gonna be a dog, bro. I'm telling you, uh, Andrew Anderson. Uh, he's back too. Not bad. I think he had a couple sacks this se uh, last season too. But he's steady. He's decent. He ain't, ain't too shabby though. Uh, but our freshman recruit, Cyrus Fofenhofer, he's back. Um, I think a lot of these guys have been in, into the SJU uh, realm in the NCAA 06. I try to tell people, hey man, 
you want to make a new character, go ahead. And if you want to bring the guys that you made in 06, it's fine. I don't mind it. But Frog Van Hammer, he was dog in the 06 version of this. And hopefully in this universe, he's a dog here as well. Um, because he's got shitty speed. You know, this man is... Hopefully he finds speed throughout his his college career. But, I mean, he's, got not, he's not bad though. 81 block shed. Um, 82 power moves with 76 finesse. Uh, strength is 79. Like, we'll work on it, man. We'll work on it. Uh, on the other side is uh, Mickey the Beast, too. He looks pretty good. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm praying for the future to be, a, like, phenomenal with these players. Hopefully, we make them into beautiful, beautiful creatures of, of just pain. You know, and dominance. We want, we want to have these guys just ripping face masks apart, you know? To the point where other teams have to wear guardian caps when they face us because they're afraid to get CTE when we step on the football field. All right. So Carson uh, McLeod, he's there too. Um, he's our senior as, as well. He was actually a dog too on the other side of um, Jay Sean. Uh, Devontae Mello is a customer recruit, so he's in here. 84 speed. Like, I'm. <sighs> some of these recruits, man, I get excited. I'm like, damn, these, these these got potential to be some dogs out here. Uh, with 70 block shed too, with 82 finesse and um, and 76 power uh, moves, too. we'll be fine. 80, you already had me. You already had me at 84 speed. Behind him is goaded Mark. He's a pass rusher too, 6'4", 272. Uh, like I said, 77 speed with 83 acceleration, strength at 78. And uh, this is the little part of uh, we have to work on him. Okay, uh, he's got 77 finesse, but power moves is 55. This boy has to rely on speed and quickness to throw his tackles and guards out of the way. Uh, but tackles at 80, which is cool. Hit power 77, pursuit 70. He's not, he's decent. He's a decent ball player. Uh, senior year, Darren Ryan Jr. That's my son. My son right there, 82 overall. Hopefully he'll be a dog. Yeah, he, he's all right. He ain't, he ain't too crazy. Now I thought he was gonna be, you know, possibly, you know. Possibly NFL draft, but this man got to find a way to work at Costco and get some double chunk chalk cookies. But yeah, anyway, 82 overall, 77 speed, um, 88 strength, 91 awareness, uh, 85 power moves for 79 finesse with 84 block shed with 88 tackle, 85 hit power, not too shabby for the kid for his senior year. Um, behind him is um, our senior Bracey Houston. Decent player. I believe he... I don't think he played for us, too. I believe he is a um, a transfer as well. Not too shabby. Um, freshman. Omar Bootskidaski Jr. He's here. I hear a lot of a lot of, a lot of smoke about this dude. Apparently, he, he's a dog standing at 6'8", 336. Yeah! Damn! So, hopefully, he becomes a dog, too, as well. Because he's got 51 speed. 57 acceleration, 55 agility, 45 change of direction. Oh, boy, gonna be, I thought this man was going to be a damn Robocop. But he does have 90 strength. He's got 86 awareness, uh, 72 play rack with 79 power and 73 fin uh, fitness. Or finesse, excuse me. Fitness. Block shed at 85, tackle at 80, 91 hit power. That two going to be breaking people off here. Um... Uh, Cooper Colt, senior, he's back. Not too shabby. He didn't really hear his name a lot, too, as well. Then we got freshman Bam Bam Lynch. This man apparently is a dog, too, man. Standing at 6'4", 400. 400. Big belly rude boy out here, man. So hopefully he becomes a dog uh, in the later years, too. But, hey, man, potential is key in the defensive line. Uh, Dorian Duncan, the junior. Didn't really play as much because this man right here, Max D'Angelo, um, his senior year, he's been a, a dog for us. So he, with 73, he plays like a nine. He's been phenomenal at work. Um, Bijan, Bijan uh, Bell, transfer here. He's a dog as well. Um, custom recruit, Eric Scott is here too. Linebacker, outside linebacker. He's got 93 speed, which I like. 86 acceleration uh, with 90, uh, 81 awareness. Uh, where's his play rack? They should play record. Why did I go past it? I think I went. I went past. It. Uh, play recognition 77. Yeah, tackling 73 with 78 hit power. So 
it, we gotta work on a little bit. That, that is what it is. But he got 73 zone, which I like. He's better than he's up there with our other linebackers too, which are like we gotta keep that in mind as well. Hopefully he becomes a dog. Um, our junior, part of our best player on the team right now, as well as Izzy I. Lewis, the middle linebacker, 90 overall, 88 speed, 80 acceleration, 84 agility, 83 came, uh, change of direction. Man, a damn near linebacker or a running back out here, but he's got 99 hit power with gold hammer. Yeah, 85 block shed. I mean, geez, Louise, you know what I'm saying? And he's got 86 zone. With 90 pursuit. This man's all over the football. I, damn, he went up to a 95. He's got 95 jumping. This dude's cheating out here. Hopefully he becomes a dog again as well because he was an absolute savage for us. Um, here. Uh, Will Wolf, uh, he's back for his senior year. He was a dog for us as well. Um, and then David Tholen, Tholen, the fourth? I don't know. I can't remember. I don't think he played at all. But the freshman, Billy the Kid. A lot of noise about him as well. 70 overall, 79 speed, 8, 83 acceleration. Excuse me, as I'm throwing up over here. Uh, the crazy part about this man is he's got 93 hit power. What are you be hitting it to make you 93? I don't know what what high school you went to, kid, but this you've been. I'm pretty sure you have to play in shackles because you should be in jail. Is what I'm saying. 93 hit 93 hit power for a freshman is crazy. Um, but he's got 82 82 pursuit. He's gonna be hawking the ball with 74 zone. I don't know who that is. Um, but yeah. He, he's a decent, decent player. So hopefully in the future he becomes a dog as well. Senior, Dean Wayne is back. Looking, he's he's looking like a stud. He was actually a pretty good stud this last season. We'll look at uh we got uh Deontay Carter. He's a sophomore, good speed, good player. Bune Coley. Um he got some touches too, a little bit too, but not really too shabby. Freshman Bubba Freeman. He's he's looking like a dog, standing at 6'9", 285. God damn, big old boy. Um, he's got 70, 87 hit power. Um, 82 acceleration, agility, 88, 85. You know, cut of direction for a, for a linebacker. What are we doing over here? Um, he's got 72 hit power. We'll work on that, though. You know what I'm saying? We'll work on that. And that. He's got um, decent uh, finesse and power moves. He's got 72 zone. So, I mean, hopefully he gets some touches this season, but we'll see. Um, but here's our DBs. DBs, I ain't gonna lie, a little rough this season. Uh, Avery Dunbar. Our senior here, 6'2", 196, 86 overall with 96 speed, 95 acceleration. Like, on paper, dog. It, just, it has to be an outcome. He's got 92 play recognition, 82 man with 89 zone. Uh, press 71, not too bad. Not, not too bad for the kid, for the senior year. He played, he had a couple crucial picks, man, that were so, so deadly. Uh, Todd, uh, Todd Healy, uh, he's our senior here. 93 speed, 81 acceleration, uh, 92 man with 89 zone with 76 press, standing at 6-1. He should be holding his own here. Uh, junior Tyrese Walker, not too bad either. He's got 88 speed. Uh, the only problem is his man in zone is uh, straight doo-doo butter. This is, this is going to be rough. Um, a lot of these guys are probably not going to be playing. We'll see, though. Um, William Browie Lee the second 77 overall with 86 speed uh, chain direction at 96 though which we like man in zone at 77 just basic stuff um, not too crazy the overall these other players AJ Gore senior Noah uh, Rustin not they're not that good DJ Walker is a custom recruit he's got he's a uh, a freshman standing at 5'11", 190, 92 speed, and he's got, you know, 79 and 59 zone. 
we're gonna have to we're gonna work on some on some of these guys here. Reggie Bales, a uh, sophomore, not too shabby. Cadillac Jones, the freshman, is here, standing at 6'3", 220, 89 speed, uh, decent stats overall, and then he's got a uh, 69 man with 79 zone. Hopefully, like you look up these papers, man. I hope they ball out on on the field because it, don't, it ain't looking good here. Uh, junior Fred Reader, Junior was uh excuse me Fred Reader Jr. Um, is a junior. He's a dog. Uh, definitely a pretty good, decent player last season. Uh, behind him is Kwa Osama, a uh, custom recruit here, six two two fifteen, standing at seventy one overall, ninety one speed, ninety acceleration, which is pretty good stats for the kid. Um, seventy five man with sixty three zone. Yikes. Uh, this guy has 79 hit power, which is pretty cool. So hopefully he can lay the lumber on people. Not too shabby. For, uh, other custom recruits. Sonny Mayo, 6'181", 69 overall, 86 speed uh, with 65, 65 man and 75 zone. <laughs> Yikes, dude. <laughs> uh, and the other one here is Eliza, jo uh, Eliza Jones, another custom recruit. But he does have some good traits too as well. I, think, I believe he's one of the only like quite a few that really don't have any like has good traits oh uh, he's got i think it was a platinum or whatever layout that i think it's like the best one in the game he's got layout and he also got gold robber so you know 69 overall with these type of stats man hopefully that'll kind of boost up his player ability because he's not bad he's got 73 man with 75 zone so hopefully those traits those abilities do wonders for him emmanuel andrews um, he's a junior too. It's so not too shabby. Uh, what up, K Dot? What up? What up? Um, you no, know, he's probably going to be playing time anyway. Uh, safety though, your entree Brockwell. He's back. He's been actually pretty good. Well, he's got house call, gold layout, and uh, silver hammer, which is pretty good. 88 overall with 93 speed, 93 acceleration, 81 uh, man with 91 zone. So he's he's out there lurking behind him. Chris Manners. This guy is an all American. I think he's all American. This guy was an absolute dog this uh, last season. Platinum. He's got hammer. He's got hammer and ball hawk. Ninety three speed. Like this man was throwing his body everywhere in, and locating the football everywhere. This damn near was a white Ed Reed out here. Um, decent stats for the kid too. Seventy one man with eighty eight zone. Lurking ball hawk. All right, he's a straight up ball hawk. Um, Michael Anthony, who cares? It's a sophomore that kind of stinks. It is what it is. Um, Custom recruit here is Chad Tracy, 6'3, 210. He's got the gold uh, natural mentality, 88 speed with 80 acceleration, 85 agility, um, with 73 zone, and 85, or excuse me, 55 man. Ugh. No bueno, but it is what it is, though. Hopefully, he'll become a dog. Hopefully, somebody can help him out as well. Safety, AOK.63190. Looking like a dog here with 90 speed, 80 acceleration. Uh, he's got 63 man with 76 zone. Um, uh, hit power at 70, so... I ain't gonna lie, though. The, the future does look pretty bright, uh, bright with these safeties, though. We, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Just hopefully he can ball out like Brockwell and Manners next season or even this season. Um, we have a senior kicker of Kevin Tucker. He's got deep range, golf and corner, and cheap shot. Which is kicking up? Really show kick? Yeah, he's got 94 kick power, 85 excellent accuracy. Um, and then we have a custom recruit, Philip Fields, 6'8, 225. Now, I was told, okay, give me a second here. I was told that he wanted to play soccer, but the coach told him, hey, man, you're too damn tall to play. Why don't you go play something else? So he moved over to kicker. We moved over to football, and we said, hey, we could probably use you. Why don't you be a kicker? Because he can hit the fucking shit out of the football, okay? And we said, hey, we saw him in practice. Hey, he's going to be a bulldog, all right? All that soccer bullshit, okay? Leave that to the side. Come, come kick for us. So yeah, he's got potential to be there as well. And hopefully he, he boots the shit out of this football. Um, and then you got Boomer <laughs> Boomer Everhart. Fire name. Boomer Everhart. But yeah, he's there. 90, he's got 99 kick power though. So why he's kind of here. 
But I mean, yeah, man, the team ain't looking too bad, man. I ain't gonna lie. The team has potential to be great, which I like to see. We have potential, okay? Do we smell national championship? I don't know. I don't know. But we will see. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling just we have another... I don't think we have a run in the playoffs this season. I think it'll possibly be another bowl game. Then we'll start cooking a little bit. All right. But after all that, we look pretty good. All right. But this is a really good schedule, though. I'm not going to lie to you. All right. We go. We go home against Nebraska, which I'm looking forward to playing. Uh, then we go to Miami of Ohio, because that's our robbery. Then we go to LSU. We go to Baton Rouge. Rank seventh. Holy shit, why? I don't know who did this, but it's it's, it's crazy. Uh, then UCF comes here. Hopefully, we beat the shit out of them. Then Iowa State comes here. Uh, then we go to Utah, uh, Utah, which I'm looking forward to for that game. Then we go to TCU. Then we play Oklahoma State. So we have two. We have three back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back jacks. Excuse me. We have four. Four away games. Okay, we go to it's Utah, TCU, Oklahoma. <laughs> and then Kansas. So, and then we have BYU week 12, and then Arizona week 13, and then Baylor at week 14 for our last game. So this... This might be a tough schedule. This might be a tougher schedule than we had last last year. I mean, week four LSU. I might get smacked in the mouth. But I'm looking forward to it, though. I'm looking forward to it. So, damn, top 25, they got Ohio State at one, Oregon at two, Penn State at three, Georgia at four, Bama at five, Michigan at six, LSU at seven, North, Car North Carolina State at eight, Rutgers at nine, Miami at 10, Ole Miss at 11, Clemson at 12, Texas A&M at 13, Boston College at 14, Iowa at 15, Tulane at 16, uh, USC at 17, Missouri at 18, Stanford at 19, MSU at 20, Florida at 21, Kansas State at 22, Auburn at 23, and Utah at 25, and Virginia Tech, excuse me, at 24, and then Virginia Tech at 25. I, wow. My top, my top 25 are crazy. I don't know what other people's are, but that's just probably buck wild. No way I'm seeing Rutgers and North Carolina State at top 10. What? All right, so preseason, All-Americans. Quinn Ewers is right there. Not too shabby for the kid. Um, Ashan, um, Ashan, Ashan Genty. I like that dude. That dude's kind of cold. Uh, is this the dude that had six rushing touchdowns? Last week or the following week. This six is insane. I think that's him, right? He was a dog. Um, I don't see any. Um, I don't see any uh, bulldogs in here. But maybe second team. Okay, here we go. Okay, I like this. Uh, you got Cody. Uh, Cody Rourke here. Not too shabby. Any other players? Just one. Okay, that's fine. I'll just. I'll just go screw myself. Um. Let me see here. Big 10 for the, or excuse me, Big 12's first team. Avery, okay, Avery Johnson. Okay. Uh, again, Cody Rourke there as well. First team for Big 12. Kevin Tucker. Okay, not two people. Preseason first team for the Big 12. Deuce Stevens. Okay. Mason Waterfield. Okay. Any, any, okay. Avery Dunbar. Okay. And Dante, Dante Brockwell. Okay. Not bad. We got some dudes out here. We got some dudes out here. Uh, Preseason Heisman. Nicholas Singleton. Genty, Ott, Ewers, and Art. Whoa! Arch Manning? Uh-oh, do I smell competition here in Texas? Ooh, okay. We got a storyline here, fellas. Tension in Texas? <gasps> you know what I'm saying? Some shit like that. Gets the people going, you know? I never talked to them boys that sat on them benches, man. I was in the game on fourth and inches. Coach, put me in the game on fourth and inches. And I'ma leave them boys at the line of scrimmage. Yeah, I see them boys all behind me, wingless. I ain't Mario Williams, but I'm not defenseless. 